It is difficult to get the loyalty and emotional attachment that brands strive for. There has to be something more, something beyond traditional marketing tools that connects loyal customers to their most beloved brands. How do we stand out? How do we get people to start caring? And what is the glue that really binds consumers to our brand and not to someone else? So what companies can do today, especially in this mass society where we're bombarded with tens of thousands of incoming messages every day, is to create a belief system to which people want to belong. And once people belong to it, they will advocate. Go Bruins! And that's where the primal code comes in. Each of these seven pieces of primal code is a point of differentiation. Everyone needs a brand narrative, they need a story. We all have a story. In 1998, two Stanford grad students launched Google from a dorm room. Do, do I know what Nike's creed is? Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Apple is a powerful, iconic brand. The Apple symbol is everywhere you look. Apple has been very successful at creating its own lexicon of i this, i that, iPod, everything. Xbox Live is very ritualistic. You just go online, you make a tasteful screen name, hit a button, and you're playing against your best friends. These are the people that don't want to be with us. They want to be a part of something else. These are what we call the non-believers. We really dislike the SUVs. They're big, they're gas hogs. We see Priuses all over the Bay Area. We feel a little connection with those people. Yeah. I'm a tall chai tea bate. I'm a grande soy mocha. I am the frappuccino sugar free hazelnut. It's really simple, passion, and vision for the brand have to come from the top down. If you look at great brands and great leaders, Jeff Immelt of GE and Steve Jobs at Apple, Richard Branson at Virgin, people feel their presence in an organization. That's branding. We all want to belong to something that's larger than ourselves and to believe in something that's larger than ourselves. 